please. Costco has publicly stated its commitment to the five freedoms, a set of values surrounding the well-being of animals at farms where Costco sources its meat, eggs, and dairy. The values state that these animals should have freedom from fear, freedom from discomfort, freedom from thirst and hunger, freedom to exhibit natural behavior, and freedom from pain and suffering. The documented truth of what happens in many Costco farm suppliers is a far cry from these basic dignities and rights. Footage taken at a Pleasant Valley Farm, at Pleasant Valley Farms, a Costco and Kirkland brand supplier here in California, shows egg-laying hens in disgusting conditions. These so-called cage-free hens are crammed together in windowless sheds by the thousands, with minimal room to move or perform any natural functions. Many are covered in feces and blood, struggling to breathe in the ammonia-filled prison. In these unnatural c conditions, the chickens often fight and even eat one another. They spend their entire lives in this nightmare, only feeling fresh air when they are taken to slaughter. Cage-free does not help chickens. It is a marketing term made up to make consumers feel better when they actually have no idea what hellish nightmare these eggs actually come from. In many cases, Costco even charges more to sell you these cage-free eggs when really these animals are trapped in one large cage. After inspecting the conditions at Pleasant Valley Farms, Costco stated that it was comfortable with the animal welfare aspects of the operation. Contrary to their commitment to the five freedoms, the eggs sourced by Costco actually come from animals who are well accustomed to feelings of fear, discomfort, thirst, hunger, pain, and suffering. Please do not be fooled by marketing terms like humane, cage-free, and grass-fed. These terms mean little to nothing to the animals who are bred into existence to live in hell until they are killed to support huge corporations like Costco. Costco has blood on its hands! 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 We are standing in a privately owned morgue surrounded by the dismembered bodies of animals whose days of execution were set before they were even born. All of these animals received a knife to the throat, after which their hearts pumped out the last ounces of blood. How can we accept this type of behavior as a civilized species? And yet refer to being kind and compassionate with the namesake humane. If you had been born a cow, pig, chicken, or other farmed animals, what reason to be killed for a meal would you accept? among an abundance of plant-based options. Please don't buy the humane lie. Give Living Vegan a try. Because Costco has blood on their hands. Costco, Costco has blood on its hands. hands! Costco has blood on their hands! Costco has blood on their hands! We represent direct action everywhere. And we are here to make you aware of a horrible lie. This lie is promoted by Pleasant Valley Farms, 
which supplies Costco with so-called organic certified eggs. We know you buy these eggs thinking the chickens live in pleasant conditions and you're willing to pay extra to support them. We know you ultimately care about animals and just as we do. But please know, our organization investigated Pleasant Valley Farms undercover and found that cage-free organic certified actually equated to thousands of crowded in chickens lying on floors in their own feces, cannibalizing each other, breathing in ammonia filled air, and many found dying or dead. Two of our investigators rescued a very sick hen that we named Ella from this horrific facility. We made these findings publicly known. Consequently, the two activists involved were charged in court and are currently appealing a ruling that says they have to pay, get this, $331,991 to cover damages which Pleasant Valley Farms claimed resulted from these activists entering the facility. That's right, damages the activists incurred in the facility for the dire and pathetic conditions I just mentioned. But what really happened? What really happened is that these activists entered wearing regulation biohazard suits, they rescued a dying hen while risking health to their own lungs, and they filmed everything they saw. What they filmed was not the commercially false, but rather the deplorable lie. Truth. As a result, they were charged for an illegal act and told to pay a huge amount of money to make amends. Does this seem discordant? Should not the legal money charges be on the shoulders of this animal agriculture business instead? Where is the morality? Where are the ethics? Why does such greed have a seat at the table? I know these two investigators. I have worked with one for four years and another for three. They are caring and compassionate people. Hands down, they, like all the activists you see here before you, are motivated solely by compassion for these animals, and in fact, for all animals, as well as for you, your listeners. Our group has a passion for the truth, and when animal agriculture lies, they do so at the expense of your own health and your own money. That is their sole purpose. We have exposed them, and that is our purpose. And we will continue to grow the use of the parts through here. This is that is why it is necessary for us to come into the store on the weekend, dedicating our personal time to tell you this. Know that we only come from love and simple truth. It's not complicated, it's not clueless, it's not extreme, but it is standing up for the rights of both animals and humans. It is saying no, the animal that cannot buy and get away with their violence. It is saying that corporations have no, zero, right to disregard the rights of anyone. We ask you to support us and join us in Tilly Costco to cease doing business with Pleasant Valley Farms. The egg products they market with deceptive sunny advertising is the complete ending of the system. Okay. Huh? What they call food is indeed nothing less than the cruelest violence. Costco itself making the following marketing claims. The chickens are free of fear and distress, free from discomfort, free from thirst and hunger, free to exhibit normal behavior, and free from pain, injury, and disease. Again, we have proven this is completely false. Tell Costco this is not acceptable. And last, please know that today is not a one-off demonstration. You will see direct action everywhere, again, in San Diego, almost anywhere. In fact, addressing many more atrocities and other animal ag farms. We want you to know, we are here to help. To help make this a compassionate planet for all, yes, all living beings. In doing so, we have a clear message that animal ag, whether they be so-called family farms or actual corporations, must not and indeed cannot rule the day any longer. Thank you. Costco has blood on its hands. 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 Die. 
humane lives. Animals do not want to die. Don't buy the humane lives. Animals do not want to die. Don't buy the humane lives. Animals do not want to die.